covering the Northern Bahamas? You're watching The Bahamas Tonight, Northern Edition. Welcome back. An international organization based in Florida traveled to Grand Bahamas some time ago to give academic awards to students. However, this year, the group returned to the island with the students of Holmes Rock Primary School in mind. Our Kimberly Mulling says their aim was to serve. Members of Samaritan's Feet have traveled to Grand Bahama Island before, taking part in their Kingdom Summit events. However, this year, a team of six ministers of the gospel, spearheaded by Apostle Terry Ball, says they return to Grand Bahama this year to carry out their Christian duty in a different way. God wants the church to become kingdom, to get into the community like this and really impact the lives of everyday people. And that's what we're doing. Samaritan Street is an organization that has an objective to use the objective of taking shoes to sew into a kid's life and to uh, bless them through, through that mechanism of not just the shoes, but also through uh, the washing of their feet showing humility and serving one another. Paul says choosing Holmes Rock Primary School wasn't hard to do. The first time we came, uh, we, our goal was to do academic awards, and we did academic awards on the first trip. Uh, and then we said when we come back, we would do uh, uh, the shoe giveaway for the kids in primary school. So Pastor Eddie, along with myself, we agreed that we would come back and just bless the school with shoes. And that's why we're here, and we're really glad to be here at Holmes Rock and uh, bless the kids with shoes at this time. All students of the school were called out of their classrooms to have their feet washed and to receive brand new pairs of shoes by the visiting ministers, as well as local members of the clergy who partner with the Kingdom Summit and take part in Samaritan's Feet. Pastor Patterson Williams of Church of Christ Apostolic believes the Samaritan's Feet initiative is a good way to reach out to children. I think this is a, a good deed to sow into their lives very early, uh, that the blessing of the Lord will be upon them as they matriculate, uh, you know, from primary to junior and uh, on the high school and on the college. Part-time administrator Linda Quan says it was nice to have the visiting pastors and local pastors at Holmes Rock Primary School and she's sure the impression would be a lasting one. We are happy that they are able to sow into the children's lives and promote that God is real in their lives and give them something tangible for them to take home. Kimberly Mullings, ZNS Network News.